void surrounds my head. Suppose I might as well be dead. She checked out my thoughts again. <coughs> oh, the ink has overflowed my pen. And I have nothing to do. I lie in the silence that's you. Always there to disobey. She never meant me any harm. My fortune's been left on her palm. It's not a lot to do when you're innocent. Oh, the guilty are in terror.
listen to the rhythm of your conversation Even though you probably could bore this whole entire nation <laughs> I stare into your eyes and every time I find this more Cause I love everything about you which I knew before Yeah, yeah And uh, some of it's from before, some of it's from after. Had the uh, uh, huge fortune of doing a lot of music while in Cambridge, and some of it's actually been performed here on the AT stage. Uh, but now it's just me on the AT stage. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're going to uh, we're going to move on and uh, play another one from those uh, murky teenage years. Uh, this uh, this one start to hear some of the repressed homosexuality. <laughs> Mr. Crocus. <laughs> <laughs> You still got one nice surprise 
all alone mm. Why are you all alone? Magic man, it is the 
truth and way Rationalistic demons make it child's play Oh, I am in awe at all your big machines Take away imagination, take away the dreams I want to know the answers, maybe we're not meant to know I want to see the future and where I'm gonna go Why is it that the ones we love and hate will always die? What happens to the life in their eyes? Oh, I've never seen my destiny at all I hope it lies in heaven Time to pray. A different kind of angel loves us more and takes us far away where we stay. <coughs> if science is the magic man. Life's a song and dance, a silver sea of evolution, ecstasy and chance. I'll never lose my way again, at least before a brave. How addictive is a life to lead without some racy faith? I don't know when I'm leaving, but time's comparative. Well, I'm still here, I want to be a living narrative. I'll watch the ones I love go and mourn for times that died. I know, I know it's just if I, yeah. I've never seen my destiny at all. I hope it lies in heaven. I've still got time to pray. A different kind of angel loves us more. Takes us far away where we stay. Is fate the old woman? Does she even exist? How does she know the right time to greet us with a kiss? <coughs> I wanna hold on tight to the ones I hold dear. I feel. Quite annoying 
really I can't believe it's true It's tearing you apart But at least it's only you You're like a million Desperate love songs Muddled into one And your sad, sad situation Is driving you insane So now I understand The poet's muse I see how nothing changes It all fits together like a mass You're just another lonely cliché The ace of spades and the jokers The ones I never knew There's not a lot to it really But it's happened to you too Leave me out of this desperate game I hate to roll the dice Chance and destiny thrive like vultures sitting on a grave of ice So, now I understand the poet's muse I see how nothing changes It all fits together like a mass produced jigsaw Can you see why nothing changes? And it cuts you like a knife Can't believe that they were right The free of love is the chase But at the end of the day like a knife, can't believe that they were right, the thrill of love is the chase, but at the end of the day, his descent into alcoholism and death. So, um, that's uh, not necessarily cheery, but it's, uh, it was very good fun to write a um, nice sort of Russian pastiche. So I hope you enjoy this. This is called Through the Painting.
and then he'll find someone better. Till then, myself, I will suppress. Yes. In order to be, in order to be, in order to be this princess. and also was at Edinburgh this summer Woo! and um, uh, this was a show which I wrote with my friend Maureen Baker, and it's um, <laughs> real keen babe. <laughs> 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 uh, probably knows the title and, <laughs> and um, it was um, uh, yeah based on um, we wanted to do a show because uh, both of us lost uh, one of our parents in our teens and so we came up with a show called Brief at the Musical and uh, the basic idea for it was that um, uh, grief is a funny little cabaret. Uh, no one knows uh, what, you're, what you're going through, you don't know what you're going through. It's like being thrust into the spotlight um, in a dream uh, with, where you don't know the words. You're having to perform, you don't know the words. Um, so it's like some sort of bad dream. Uh, basically, uh, this is one of the first songs which I wrote for the show before I knew that there was going to be a show. Um, and it deals with some of the issues of um, <coughs> communication and um, uh, wanting to be able to communicate with people but having a bit of a difficulty. Thank you very much for that. 
Uh, just like to say again, thank you so much for uh, so many of you coming, and it, it means that we've raised, uh, I don't know quite how much, but a lot of money for flat tonight. Uh, for those of you who don't know, this, um, uh, all the money that we raised is going to go uh, to flat, which is a wonderful uh, charity in Cambridge, and um, it, it basically it's for uh, homeless people and for uh, people in the community who've lost uh, so much. And uh, one of their main projects is working on this magazine, and it gets. Um, uh, these people, you know, working and it and it gives them a sense of purpose and uh, gives them back something which they've lost uh, and really gets them on the right foot again. So big, massive thank you to uh, Flack and to all of you for coming and supporting them tonight. And uh, we're going to um, uh, do another song from the uh, before Cambridge time. And uh, yeah, I hope you like this one. This is called Lifeline. Uh, yes, no, of course. But uh, it was a very, very strange feeling. 
And um, <laughs> I was writing this song in the music room in school, and then I left, and when I came back, um, someone had uh, scribbled out a couple of the words and uh, replaced them, and it was purple ink, but I still had no idea who it was. And uh, <laughs> so, uh, anyway, so I'm going to do the first verse will be my uh, original lyrics, and the second verse will be the altered lyrics. <laughs> <laughs> But um, it's very interesting to find a song from uh, back then and see it with another point of view. <laughs> Child, I appeared a little 
have been born with all my crazy ideas But I knew what was happening, I knew I was a genius I think that it's you instead. <laughs> Got a thing that's unique and new, and it'll go to prove I'll have the last laugh on you. Cause instead of one head, I've got two. <laughs> and you know, two heads are better than one. <laughs> <laughs>